if the human wave, uh, I mean, grows and remains strong enough, eventually we'll, we'll be able to knock down those walls, you know, at, at the political level. Public outrage in Quebec this weekend after an indigenous woman went public with her deathbed humiliation. Joyce Echequan recorded herself last Monday during a hospital stay in Joliette, north of Montreal. You can hear staff making racist remarks and calling the Atikamek woman stupid. A nurse and an orderly have since been fired, but the video sparked an outcry that led to yesterday's protest in Montreal that drew thousands. Justice! Fresh off organizing that protest, Nagouset says the government's public inquiry into Echequan's death is an important victory. Because it's not an inquiry on everyone, it's on one specific case that is making an example, a concrete example of why systemic racism is so wrong. In a statement, the Atikamek Council of Manawan said that, along with Eshaquan's family, it welcomes the public inquiry. The council says community members had already spoken out about the racism and abuse they experienced at Joliet Hospital, but that nothing has changed. I would really like the, uh, the, the protests to continue every single day in every uh, different province. Although it was not as big of a turnout, today people gathered in Toronto. I think I have like seen it all in the over 30 years of doing this work and then something like this happens and I realize no, you know. In a statement today, Premier François Legault said it's his government's duty to ensure everyone is treated equally, but he stopped short of doing what many say he must do, acknowledge that systemic racism exists in Quebec. Anthony Nerestan, CBC News, Montreal.